Uh, bodybuilding fans, this is uh, John Muir, Premier Physiques. And uh, to my left is Mr. Jason Hamner. He is going to be competing in the North Americans in the light heavyweight class in about three days. And uh, he just won the heavyweight class in the Coastal USA's last week. And we're going to watch him pose in here in just a few minutes. And uh, the man to my right obviously needs no introduction, Mr. Lee Banks, national level competitor for the last four years. Uh, just took third at the Nationals last November in the heavyweights, third at the USA's just a few weeks ago, yep. And uh, we're going to hope to uh, go pro here at the North Americans. So we're going to get these guys undressed and show you what they look like three days out from the North American. All right, as you can see, as usual, Lee's big and full and hard. You just go, go ahead and go through your mandatories, buddy. Three days out. Definitely, definitely pro material. Just uh, round and full and just round muscle bellies. And ironically, um, our hometown pro here in Jacksonville, Mr. Dexter Jackson, um, who I've actually been training with a little bit for his uh, Mr. Olympia in a couple weeks, turned pro at the North American 10 years ago. So uh, we're kind of hoping to bring Lee in 10 years later as uh, Jacksonville's second pro. But uh, Lee just gets better and better. Uh, obviously, you know, maturity on his side. Um, just tiny waist, thick round back, wide clavicles. He's just got everything going for him. He's brought a lot of improvement to his legs, his calves. His midsection is nice and tight. And uh, I think we're going to do some damage this year. Lee, um, obviously we're you know doing things a little different this time for the North Americans. Tell me how you feel differently compared to how we you know how you felt at the USA's a couple weeks ago. Well, um, I feel a lot fuller right now. I feel um, that um, I'll be a lot rounder. Um, one of my my traits, my, my positive traits, is my roundness, and I just I believe that we're going to bring that in this show. I believe the fullness is going to be there, and you can really see the roundness in my physique. Yeah, basically what we did for the USA's is we kind of, we tried to play the dry, shredded game, and uh, I, I brought you in really light, really hard, really dry. You were 214 for that show. Uh, last year at Nationals, you came in at 218, and I think what we're going to try and do this time, and you were a week out from the USA's, you were 222 pounds and looked amazing. So I think what we're going to do for this time for the North Americans is try and keep around between 222 and 225 get you bigger, fuller, and of course your condition will be there. Just go right through them, buddy. Now obviously you can see the difference. Jason's a, a light heavyweight, but still just packing plenty of muscle on his frame. Uh, got huge chest, great legs. Jason gets very dry, very hard. Look at his chest is already striated, big and full. Now Jason uh, suffered a pec tear just this past March and uh, actually didn't train chest for a couple months, but it actually may have helped him, to be honest with you, with his symmetry. And again, we're three days out, so these guys are still a little flat and not dry and not tanned up, but we're looking to do some damage with these two two guys at the uh, North Americans. All right, we're here with Mr. Jason Hamner, national level competitor. Uh, now, Jason, the first time we worked together, uh, was it two years ago? Yeah, two year, 2006, uh, All South. Two years ago, All South. It's the first time we worked together. Um, Jason came in very dry, very shredded, very hard. Um, actually didn't get the overall on that one, um, but uh, I think you lost by one point to, to Jason Croce. Yes, <laughs> I remember. Anyways, so uh, that was my first time working with Jason, but basically what we're going to do this time is um, obviously bring him in a little bigger and a little fuller. He weighed in at 194 for the All-South two years ago, and uh, like I said, he just won the heavyweight class at the Coastal USA. He came in at 205, and actually for the North American for weigh-ins Thursday night 
we're going to bring him down, hopefully right down to 198, and then uh, get him nice and full for the next uh, for the next day for prejudging. So, what have you noticed differently this time as far as how your contest prep went, your training? I mean, just anything that you kind of noticed that was different. Uh, this time, dieting, you know, I noticed that you know in the in the past two years, I, I did make some gains and some stuff I was trying to bring up. So. Uh, hopefully, be a little bit bigger. Um, we'll make the same mistakes as before, and then uh, you know push it down to the the top of the light heavies. Yeah, we basically learned um, from your last show that because your metabolism is so fast, that we basically gonna have to feed you up about every hour or so with some good food and some junk, and kind of play with your water a little bit. But hopefully, we'll uh, we'll nail this time. And, and basically, what's your goal for the North American? I'd like to uh, just uh, make the the top 15. That's that's my goal. Well, hopefully my goal is to get him in the top 8 or 10, so we'll see what happens.